Hey there, it's Andrew from BackcountrySkiingCanada.com. How are you doing today? We're here today to talk about the Red Paddle Co. 12 foot 6 inch paddleboard that I have here in front of me. Uh, Red Paddle Co. has been around for about, well, since 2008, and they make uh, ISOPs or inflatable paddle boards exclusively. So this is um, one of 19 boards offered by Red Paddle Co. And they have different categories. There's an all around, there's touring, there's a race segment, junior, yoga, whitewater, surf, and wind sum. A couple cool features, oh, and I should, should say that this is within the touring line. Um, the sport and the explorers are both within the touring line. A couple cool features on this particular board. One is the RSS, which you can see right here, it's the bat. We'll take a still shot of this later on, but it's something that makes it way stiffer than it would be without. It fits into a sleeve right here and it's a hard fiberglass bat on both sides, just slightly ahead of where you put your feet. So that's a good stiffener. And then there's another thing called the MSL, which is the monocoque structural laminate. <coughs> and that's a second layer of polymer that helps with the drop stitch and makes it stiffer and actually reduces the overall weight by two kilograms. <coughs> As you may have guessed from the 12.6, this is a 12 foot 6 inch board and the width is uh, 30 inches, which is um, 600, 7, 762 millimeters. Now the other board in the uh, touring class is called the Explorer and it's 32 inches wider, wide, so it's a little bit more stable but less quick. Um, as far as the thickness of this goes, it's 6 inches. 5.9 inches, which is um, considerably thicker, about two inches thicker than the first generation of uh, inflatable paddle boards. It makes it stiffer and a better ride in general. The overall volume is 350 liters, so it's a fairly substantial board, and uh, it'll support a weight up to 300 pounds, or 330 pounds, excuse me, 100, 150 uh, kilograms. So I'm 175 pounds. Um, I've done overnight trips putting a 30 pound pack in the front here and it's worked really well. So um, as far as what you get in the, the box, and we'll uh, show you a still photograph of that later, there's a, uh, the RSS battens, which I've showed here, um, the backpack, which we'll also take a look at, the Titan pump, which is really, really super cool. We'll take a look at that too. Uh, and then the US fin box, which is back here, kind of a universal standard fin that will fit in any, any, uh, any paddleboard, most paddleboards, excuse me. And uh, you also get a free water-resistant phone case. So a couple minor issues with the um, Red Paddle Co. 12.6. Uh, the pump, which again, we'll take a look at later, the connection between the hose and the actual pump itself could be in metal. It could be a little bit uh, more solid. It's a little bit flimsy. Um, and that's, that's the only issue I have, really. This is a... A great board. I've uh, been riding on it all all summer. Um, windy conditions, tracks well. It's fast, way more fast than the uh, Seville or Willow that I had last year. Um, so all in all, it's a great board and highly recommended. Hey there. So let's take a look at the Titan Pump from Red Paddle Co. Uh, I'm talking about this because it's a definite highlight of the whole uh, the whole program. It's uh, two cylinders allows you to pump things up faster and with less energy. So it all comes down to this little this little thing here. So when you're just starting to pump up, you have two cylinders working. You can see that's like really, really difficult because the board is actually mostly pumped up now. But to make it easier, you simply pull this out and there's only this little guy that's acting as, as the pump. So you pump like this. So, um, two cylinders. At first to start pumping you have two cylinders working and then you pop this thing out and it only uh, the smaller cylinder is activated. So just a great feature. The Titan pump from Red Paddle Co. If you'd like to uh, check out other reviews of paddle boards, our growing paddle board uh, review section, go to the site and uh, there's lots of other good stuff there too. See you later. Andrew saying goodbye.